I am back with another video. If you're here, make sure you subscribe. If you've been here before, welcome back. How are you guys doing today? Because I am doing great. It has been a nice day. It's a little hot, but hey, you know, we're going to get, you know, we're going to do it. So, if you guys can tell by the title, today I'm having jerk chicken nachos. I have been craving this all day. Like, I literally told myself, I'm going to go home and have jerk chicken nuggets for today's mukbang. That's what we're going to do. I was so excited to come home and eat. Like, oh my God, I have been craving this all day. Mm. Oh my God, it's so far. It has been a very busy day today. But, um, you know, it was a day. The jerk sauce that I use, I use the hot and spicy. Oh my god, this so bad. I didn't gonna lie to y'all. I wouldn't lie to y'all. My chips breaking. It's so good. Mmm. It's so simple. And we got me some chicken tenderloins. I marinated the jerk in it. Let's sit in the fridge for about 30 minutes. The lettuce was already shredded. Cut up my tomato. And then I cut up the little chicken tenderloins after the 30 minutes. Put them in a pan. You know, let them cook up. Had my cheese going on the other side on the stove. I just threw everything together and I got some flaming Hot Doritos. Bomb. Hold me up right there. Mmm. So far. So like I said, I've been doing good today. Today was a good day. It went back pretty quickly, which I was hoping for because I was ready to come home and eat. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I've been thinking about doing this mug bang all day. I was ready to come home and eat, okay? Mm. Now, nachos is one of my favorite foods. I could literally eat nachos every day all day long like no problem at all nachos wings i mean you know how people always say pizza is their favorite food i'm not that type of person pizza is not my favorite food i could eat pizza but it's not my favorite food to where i would eat it like every day with nachos wings and seafood oh guys speaking of seafood we are currently at 63 subscribers when I reach 100 subscribers, we will be doing a seafood boil. So please, please, please subscribe. Don't just watch. Subscribe. Say your mama, auntie, uncle, cousin, Jeff, cousin that cheated on Auntie Tony to subscribe to Amina's Eats. Like, come on. When I reach 100 subscribers, I will be doing a seafood boil. And y'all will get to know. Amina loves seafood. Girl. I would test the people up, okay? So please, please, please make sure y'all subscribe. Um, I can't believe that next week is going to be October. Like, next Friday, it'll be October 1st. And that's crazy because it's like September just got here. And it's like, dang. We already, like September said, let me come on in so I can come on out. That's what I like to see. You know, come on. You know, time is of the essence. And, you know, y'all, I've been doing, like, me and my boyfriend have been talking and stuff. And, like, you know, we got a lot of we got a lot of goals that we have. You know, like, graduation is approaching. We're adulting. Sooner or later, we'll, we're more closer to 18 than we are to 17. And, you know, it's going to be time to be doing stuff and apply for college. Well, neither one of us are going to college or actually going to trade school. But, like, still, we have to do apply for this stuff we have to learn so much and it's just in so little time it feels like and it doesn't even feel like i'm a senior like these four years of high school went by so fast it's crazy it does not feel like i'm a senior it does not feel like i'm about to graduate high school and actually move on with my life like but like one half is scary but my other half is like i'm ready you know, like, last night, I was just 
really sitting up thinking to myself like i really have to make plans for stuff and so i'm i'm just gonna tell you right now i can be a really lazy person I'm trying to get out of that i can be so lazy i'm really trying to get out of that but i can be a lazy person and so i told myself you know instead of me just sitting here watching tv watching the same show i've seen 10 times already i could be doing something productive so don't clown me y'all i've had i've opened up a bank account like so long ago like i don't even remember when credit card came in the mail and everything stuff just been sitting on my dresser literally been sitting on my dresser for months have not touched it at all and you know I'm like, I have to do this. Like, I have to get some stuff in order. I really have to get my life together. So, I got that together last night. And, you know, I separated my money, put in my actual account, and then put on my savings part. So, I've separated it to where it has my spending amount and then my money that I have saved. And I've set a goal for myself. And the goal that I set for myself is to have $1,000 saved by January 1st. <clears throat> Excuse me. And... The name of the goal that I put, I've actually put it as undecided. Because I don't really have, although I have a few things I could be saving for, but I don't want to put a name on it. I don't want to be specific yet. I just want to know that I have $1,000 saved put away for myself. I never know what I'm going to need it for. You know, I have things that I do want to buy, you know, but I don't want to put a name on it yet. We're just, just going to see what happens, you know, so... I think things go better when you don't put a label on some things, at least. Mmm. So bomb. I'm telling y'all, this is hitting right now. If you're not a person who likes spicy foods, I wouldn't recommend this. Because this is very hot. Between the hot and spicy jerk sauce, flaming hot Doritos... And a hot cheese, I wouldn't recommend. Mm. But yeah, you know me and my boyfriend, we have goals and stuff. And like I said, I put a goal of mine was to get a thousand to have a thousand dollars saved by January first. And um, also this week i will be calling different cosmetology schools like in my area and asking them all the same questions and writing it down so i can compare to see which one is more beneficial for me to go to so i'll be doing that because like i said like time is of the essence i'm gonna look up and it's gonna be may 22nd 2022 and i'm gonna be walking across the stage and then when May 23rd game, I'm going to be like, what I'm doing? You know, I want to have my stuff in order. You know, I'm proud of myself. Proud of my boyfriend, too, because, you know, he's, he's, he got his foot into doing to what he wants to do in life. And I'm proud of him. Like, he could be a little introverted or something that he wants to do. So I'm proud of him for that. You know, we got goals going on. You know. But yeah. But, you know, I hope um everyone is getting a chance to read their goals. They suggest the goals that they want. I hope y'all getting a chance for that. Um, oh, I also, because I've been, like I said, I'm just lazy. And I'm really trying to get out of that. Please, like, don't clown me. I'm really trying to get out of it. I've also said... That I need to start working on my mannequin more because I have not worked on my mannequin in so long. It's just sitting there collecting dust. I need to work on my mannequin more. And I need to teach myself how to do two hairstyles. I'm not quite sure what the hairstyles are going to be yet. But I, knew I, I know I need to teach myself how to do two of them. Because I'm just falling so behind. So, we're going to do that. You know, baby steps, one thing at a time, you know. I have a lot going on. I'm trying to make sure... I get everything that needs to be done in the school first because I will be graduating one time. I can promise you that. And I'm trying to get my license. 
and um do this driving school so I can get the rest of my hours. Y'all, we just got I just got a lot on my plate, but we gonna do it. And that just reminds me that I got a test Wednesday that I need to study for. Ooh, child. But it's okay, because we're going to be okay. We're going to be okay. But what y'all got going on? You know, like, what goals do y'all have? Put in the comment section down below the type of goals that y'all have, whether they long or short-term goals. And what steps are you going to take to achieve them? I would really love to know about those. It would be nice to sit and read the different goals that people have. You know, I really want to interact with y'all. So don't be afraid. Ask me a question. Anything. Throw me a like. Subscribe. Share. You know. <laughs> oh, it doesn't look like I got my hair done. I told y'all I was getting a new hairstyle this weekend. I didn't know what it was going to be. But we finally came to a conclusion. I got some skinny feet in braids. At first, I'm not going to lie. At first, I was a little iffy. I was like, hmm... I don't know how I feel about this. But now I'm like, okay, this works for me. It definitely works. But that last hair cell I had, that lasted me for two weeks. <clears throat> Excuse me. That lasted me for two weeks, so that's what I'm trying to do. Work on um having my hair size in for a longer period of time. Cause I like to take my hair down like hair is cheap. Or getting your hair done is cheap. And it's definitely not. Now, you know, sometimes I have a little advantage because, like I said, I work in a hair salon. But still, that's people's time. And I still got about hair. I'm only about to play on my time. I'm not going to play with this. Y'all. And I purposely made enough for me to have again tomorrow if I so choose. Because so far. I haven't had nachos like this in a minute. Like, you no know, homemade full blown out nachos. Don't be the best. Some jerk chicken nachos. Ooh, I might have to do some jerk shrimp. But, y'all know, as we do on every video, I like to do a mental health check in. So, how are you guys doing mentally? Mentally, I can say I'm okay. You know, I've been thinking very positive lately. Been thinking about my future heavily. You know, where I'm going to be in five to ten years. And sometimes it's not even five. It's like two to three. Like, where am I going to be? You know, I know what I want to do. But, you know, where am I going to be is the question. But, you know, all I can keep doing is having faith, you know, and it will work out for you. So far. I don't be exaggerating when I, when I say how good my food is. I really don't. Because if it wasn't as good... And the way I'm claiming it to be, I wouldn't be doing all that. But it really is just that good. Like, oh my God. And nachos is my thing, so I could bang some nachos. As y'all see, I just did it here. Whew. Yeah. And that's when Jay Way was supposed to give. I ain't gonna lie, I'm full now. But I ate most of my food. I pretty much ate all of it. I just have a few pieces of chicken left. That right though, it gave. But you know, I hope you guys are doing well. Make sure you guys go follow me on TikTok. My TikTok will be in the description down below. I will be coming out with more videos on how I make certain things. You know, let me know what you guys want to see. I don't care what it is. Let me know foods that you guys want to see me eat or even make. You know, I would do that. 
my tiktok will be in the description down below and amina 18 make sure you guys go follow me go like my latest video comment share all that make sure you like comment share and subscribe <laughs> excuse me tell your mama auntie uncle tony joe sister bertha pedro all them make sure you come over to amina's east and subscribe we do life updates we do positive affirmations we eat most of all we do it all so make sure you guys do that. You guys are just so amazing. Thank you for all the love and support. Don't forget that when I reach 100 subscribers, I will be doing a seafood boil. So make sure you guys share and get me up there so we can have a seafood boil and then we can go on from there. Like I said, I hope you guys are happy, healthy, and blessed because I am all three. Do you eat? Because Amina eats. Bye. Hey, whoa, whoa.